How you doing, Scotty Bear? Back with another Wake and Bake. My buddy said I should come up with a jingle, so that was it. Uh, it's another Domingo. And uh, just seven days from now, which is, of course, next Sunday, I'll be on my way to a new place. Gotta look over there. Hold on. Gotta be careful over here. The, uh, out here, right out here, I almost got, uh, busted by the police for smoking marijuana. I mean, it was one of those moments, too. They were <laughs> right out in front of me. I was like, oh, I don't even know how they got so close to me without me seeing them. Of course, Look around the ocean, uh, you know, you can see ATVs coming at you pretty quickly. Hope I gave you a nice shot while I was trying to light the, the hooter up, the heater. I don't know why I do Airbnbs, honestly, because I don't like change all that well. So it would seem strange that I would be, I'm not sure if it's tracted is the right word, but continue. I mean, I perfectly felt comfortably comfortable enough in El Paso. Hold on, you gotta look over there again. It's a big hooter. I'm gonna check my filming. All right, I'm gonna make sure I was not too high and forgot to push the record button. Hold on. There's two boats over there in the marina right now. Make sure they're not sneaking up on me. Here, take another look. See, two. Trying to make our way up the hill here for a slightly better view this morning. Hope you all are having a wonderful Domingo. I'm deciding on what's for breakfast. Like I was saying before, I don't necessarily love change, which uh, leads me to wonder why I rent Airbnbs and the change is ongoing, right? You're uh, constantly planning, you're constantly changing, it's, uh, maybe I feel like I love planning or something. I'm not a great planner either, like many of these Airbnbs I booked, which another blogger brought up this uh, situation is I booked them in, within the same day. That's one of the things that most of the nomads are complaining about in uh, their blogs is, you know, the 180 day visa will go away because it, it uh, kind of removes the flexibility of, you know, being in Mexico in the first place. I don't know. I don't think Mexico's checking on it that hard. However, they they may start, right? They may start. Well, you gotta look at the ocean again. What's nice over there? I'd like to hike out there, maybe. It might be just a little far from where we are today. Or here in general. Kind of nice. Back to my talking about change. 
We're definitely looking to experience some new things, so not the same old, same old. However, I may, like I've talked about in past videos, kind of um, decide to take a little pit stop so I can get over into San Diego and pick up some things I'd like to travel with, watch the ocean again. Got a f few ideas. I'm circling around a few ideas, looking at costs and the whole shebang behind it. I like the costs to get to Guadalajara and over there. Uh, really, that's that's on a list. I mean, La Paz isn't not on a list, but Guadalajara is on the list. Like I haven't been to Guadalajara, so. You know, I'd like to try to get, get to that one, get that one checked off the list. I also would like Costa Rica, too. Um, Costa Rica currently doesn't have any real travel restrictions. So, um, there's that. How, however, I'm still, like, got my fingers crossed for Hanoi. That's, that's the one. Hanoi is the one I have a feeling. I look at the ocean again. There are many, you know, Asian destinations open. Don't be, um, don't be confused uh, because Cambodia is open. Bali, I believe, is open. How, however, the problem is, is you know, getting to these places because the, you know, the same, um, you know, airline ways that cur currently existed before the pandemic are, are, you know, now not as frequent and stuff like that. Like you could fly to Bangkok from the West Coast somewhere, probably every two hours. I wonder if that's the case anymore. Vietnam, probably the same way. But, I mean, anywhere in Asia. You just get anywhere in Asia, it just becomes a... Just walk up to the counter, buy a ticket anywhere for $20, $30, dollars So, you just... The goal is just to get on the Asia side. And then just start taking airplanes from there. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this Wake and Bake. I'm going to be selfish and finish this blunt myself. Talk to you later.